count to three, two. And with the base loaded here in the bottom of the ninth, what a moment this could be for young Mo Mayweather. Of all the radioactive animals I could have been bitten by as a kid, it had to be a sloth. As you can see, when I was little, I was obsessed with sloths. And on my fourth birthday, I got to go and pet one. It did not go well. In other news, a boy was bit by a sloth at the Coco City Zoo. This is very confusing. I never found out why the sloth bit me. Or why it was radioactive in the first place. But what I did know, I had developed the most useless superpower of all time. I started going into slow motion whenever I did anything too active. Racers on your marks. Three, two, one, go! Like playing outside with my friends. Or playing inside with my friends. And every time I thought I could control it, found out I couldn't. Did you bring the mattress in case I fall too fast? No, your mom said we couldn't use it. Now, as I was saying, the jump of a lifetime. He's okay. So I grew up, stopped having fun, and got a job at the local Quickie Mart. It was just less dangerous. Excuse me, young man. I don't need the whole package of napkins. Is it possible that I could buy just one napkin? Uh, no, I'm sorry. You have to buy the whole pack. All right, well, have a good day. It was then I had an epiphany. All my problems started when a sloth bit me. All I had to do to go back to normal was to bite the sloth. Okay, so explain this to me again one more time. The sloth bit me. I got sloth powers. If I bite the sloth, those powers should transfer right back. Then by that logic, if you bite the sloth, wouldn't it get human powers or something? No. Any other questions? So when you want to go? Good luck in there. Just don't get stuck in there too long. It's only 30 minute parking. All right. You got it, Mo. Don't die. What? Don't, don't, don't die. What do you mean? You're a jerk. Just looking out for him. <laughs> no, not my DS.
got a reason to be back here? Uh, the sloth? I I'm looking for the sloth. I'm here with the internship. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, the internship. That's a great opportunity, ain't it? You know, I was once an intern a long time ago, back in college. Ooh, good times. So, the sloth? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, oh Willie, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's dead. Uh, about six and a half weeks ago, ain't you heard? Well, I'm gonna go lock up. You have a good night now. Sorry about the sloth, buddy. Jordan? Mo? Sloth's dead. I'm on my way out. The sloth is what? Just what I said. I got here, and the sloth was... Hello? Dude, where are you at? It's been like 20 minutes. We're gonna get a ticket. Mo? Callie, and this is Wilbur. Wilbur is a Hoffman's two-toed sloth. As you can see, sloths are typically not very aggressive animals. Wilbur was born right here at the zoo and she is 17 years old. If you are interested in meeting Wilbur, you can come and visit her here at the Palm Beach Zoo. I've been searching my whole life for someone like you. Someone who understands my heart the way that you do. But now that you're here, girl, I don't know what to say. Five, ten, take one. As I was saying, the jump of a lifetime. Take three. Action. Now, as I was saying, the jump of a lifetime. Ten, take two. Now, as I was saying, the jump of a lifetime. He's a bed. Oh, so powerful! Did you Here use the leaf floor inside <laughs> what you expect? 